What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. On today's video, we're gonna be going over the Kegel foot pedal. Now, you can see on the pictures here, there's a single, double, and triple. We're gonna be testing out the single today. And if I like it, I might upgrade to a triple. If you're new here, my name's JJ and I do live stream daily. So make sure to hit that subscribe button with bell notifications on. That way you don't miss out on future content or live streams. I will also have an Amazon affiliate link to this pedal in the description down below. That way if you want to check it out, you can go ahead and do so. All right guys, well, let's go ahead and jump into the video and start setting this bad boy up. So in the box, we just have the foot pedal with a USB, connect that right into the computer, pretty simple. And then we do have a little CD here, a little software, I guess to download. We have a little instruction manual and some warranty stickers and stuff like that. So it's pretty simple. We're just gonna have to download the software that way we could set it all up and should be good to go. So first thing we're gonna do is go to the website and download the software, so pcsensor.com. It also shows it right here in the user manual. Then we're gonna click foot switch. It's gonna pop up with these versions and we're just gonna download the latest version. Once you download the software, open up the file, hit this foot switch um, application right there, open it up, it'll ask you to extract all and then the main menu will pop up. And then it should take you to this screen right here. So once you plug in your device, it should find it and you can select what you wanna do with it. So. Up here it shows you, you can have it key bound to some things for your keyboard. Um, like if you want it to pretty much be your alt button every time you hold it or control windows, all that fun stuff, any key on your keyboard. You can use it for things on your mouse. Like if you want it to act as a left mouse button or anything like that, maybe move your mouse around your screen. And then string, you can make it do multiple things like string things together. So as soon as you click it, it'll do a bunch of different things in a sequence. And then multimedia, if you wanted to like play, stop a video, forward, you know, next song, mute, all that fun stuff. You can even have it set up for like a controller for a game. Move up, down, buttons. So you can get really creative with this and find ways that it can benefit you. So the reason I got this is for the stream. When I'm streaming, I don't want people to hear me talking to chat. So I'll use the foot pedal to go ahead and mute uh, Discord and that way I can talk to chat and then unmute. So right now my keybind to toggle deafen, which pretty much mutes me and mutes everybody in my Discord so I don't hear them, they don't hear me. It is, the keybind is numpad plus. So I'll go over here and I will make this the same keybind. So numpad plus right there. And you can set it to either be pressed on the trigger, so as soon as you press it, or on the release of when you press the foot pedal. So once we have that set up, we can go ahead and save to key. Go ahead and save it, successful. Okay, and now we're gonna test it out. So I have the foot pedal here just so I could test it. And here's Discord. So you see right now I'm deaf and, and muted. So as soon as I click it, comes off, click it again, back on. And also just so you can get an idea of what it sounds like, this is the amount of noise it makes. So I was just trying it out with my foot and honestly it's pretty easy to press with your foot so it doesn't take a lot of strength which is good for a lot of people. So as you can see guys the setup is really easy and you can get so creative with this and come up with different ways to take advantage of it. This can really help if you have like say disability or you're injured and you can't really use your hands that well. You can have your feet help you out. Um, some creative ways to use this is there's some shooter games where you lean left, lean right. Some people have two pedals, one to lean left, one to lean right. That way you don't have to take your fingers or your hands off the keyboard and mouse. Uh, you can use it to just open up your map, close out your map, things like that. So you can get super creative with this. And I mean, you could plug a bunch of these in and just tap dance your way to victory in Warzone if you really wanted to. Well guys, if you enjoyed this product, once again, link is in the description. This is not a sponsored video or anything. It's just something I wanted to get. It's like a quality of life for streaming. So it's really beneficial for you streamers out there. And if you want, you can check me out live on YouTube, Twitch, and Facebook. And you can come ask me any questions, come hang out and get some dubs in Warzone. And make sure to hit that subscribe button with bell notifications on, hit that like button, all that fun stuff. I appreciate it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks.